New York's JFK becomes first airport to have on-site coronavirus testing for employees. To view the full article, click the first link in the description below. You can get anything at the airport now, even a COVID-19 test. As air travel begins to pick up amid the coronavirus pandemic, airlines are focusing on ways to keep their employees and customers safe and healthy. John F. Kennedy International Airport, JFK in New York City is now the first airport to have an on-site testing location for the virus and antibodies. The Port Authority of New York and New Jersey said the pilot program is open to all employees for the JFK terminal, airlines and other airport workers. The site has the ability to screen up to 500 employees per day, according to a press release. Airlines may start using special cameras to enforce mask wearing regulations. The modular testing site was developed by Express Spa and is referred to as Express Check. The site, located in the arrivals hall at Terminal 4, has nine separate testing rooms. The Port Authority is pleased to open the nation's first COVID-19 and antibody testing facility for employees at JFK International Airport with Chi at JFK International Air Terminal and Express Spa, said Kevin Atul, Port Authority Chairman. The agency will continue to enhance safety at its facilities by piloting the new technologies, programs, and policies needed to manage the impact of the coronavirus outbreak. Click here to get the Fox News or Cotton, Port Authority Executive Director, said. Safety and security are the Port Authority's top priorities, and opening the new Express Check COVID-19 pilot program builds on measures the agency has taken to protect travelers and airport workers across the region. Today's announcement is an important addition to our commitment to providing a safe facility for workers and travelers alike. Follow us on Facebook for more Fox Lifestyle News. We have always looked for ways to better serve our employees, passengers, and frontline airport workers at Terminal 4, and in the wake of the COVID-19 pandemic ensuring us safe. To view the full article, click the first link in the description below.